wanted this figure ever since 2014, and here he is, the power of the sun in the palm of my hand. Oh my gosh, I love this figure already. And this guy got it um, in 2004, apparently got it on clearance. 2004 or five, he got it on clearance for $2.84. That is crazy. Um, it comes with the pole flag that I'll show you in a second. But just look at that Spider-Man. Oh my gosh, the magnetic hands. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, Toy Biz. I wish you weren't shut down. Hasbro is doing a horrible job with um with your Mar with your Marvel Legends six inch line. You you really need to come back. Okay, so looking at the figure, it's pretty nice. I love, the, I absolutely love the magnets on the hands. They are so cool. Um, I've been sticking it on other places. It's, it's like really cool. I just love this guy. I'm just posing him around and stuff. Um, there's not much to talk about. In some areas, it seems like there's like a little bit of. Uh, it's just, there's just a little bit of weird spots. I had a problem with mine for, um, as soon as I took mine out the box, the next day it got super loose. Like, like this man is wiggling like a freaking worm over here. It's, it's really weird. Um, I still love this figure. It's still my favorite figure for now. But he is, he is possibly one of, he's pro this is definitely, a better figure than the magnetic, uh, the magnets on the Mayfex Spider-Man. Remember that figure with terrible magnets that would like fall off and it would be real dumb and stuff. Yeah. Um, he does kind of stay on the pole for the most part. You take my now you think it is fine Doesn't make me so 